Hello, and welcome to In the Kitchen with Matt. I'm your host, Matt Taylor. Today, I am gonna teach you how to make classic Belgian waffles from scratch. Let's get started. For the ingredients, we need two cups of flour, four eggs separated, two cups of milk, we need two tablespoons of sugar, we need one half stick of butter, which is about four tablespoons, we need a half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, we need a half a teaspoon of salt, and we need two teaspoons of baking powder. So first, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our sugar and we are gonna combine it with our eggs. Great. Then we're gonna take our mixer and we are gonna just mix this together. Okay. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our melted butter and go ahead and add that. Take our vanilla extract and go ahead and add that. And let's take our milk and go ahead and add that. And we'll give it a light mix. Not too much. We're gonna take our flour, and we'll go ahead and add that. It's okay if it doesn't get all in there. Salt, baking powder. Go ahead and just sift it. If you don't have a sifter, then don't worry about it. Okay. And now I'm just gonna take a hand whisk and I wanna mix it together instead of using the mixer for this part. Don't wanna over mix it. Get it so it's all nice and mixed together. Like that, great. Now the next part is we have our egg whites here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch out the uh, the attachment on my old hand mixer and get this little uh, whisk. And I'm gonna whisk this until it's nice and mixed and there's peaks formed. All right, our egg whites are nice and mixed. And the reason why we have these separated is it's gonna help to make our waffles nice and fluffy. Okay, then what we do is we just take our egg whites and we'll, we'll just pour it in there. Okay, set that aside. We'll take our whisk again and we're just gonna barely fold it all in there. We don't wanna over mix it at all. We just wanna lightly get it all folded in. Just fold it in like that. And now our batter is ready to go. On to the next step. Okay, once our waffle iron is heated up, we'll go ahead and give it a good spray, the kitchen spray. All right, and we will get some batter here. This one has a little line on it. Okay. We'll go ahead and put it all over. Close it, turn it upside down, and wait until it is done. Mine has an indicator light when it's done and it'll beep. All right, it's ready to go. We'll turn it back over, open it up, and wow, look at that. Amazing. You just take a little fork like this, and grab it, and put it on your plate, and on to the next one. And you keep doing that until they are all done. All right, our classic Belgian waffles are done. They were super easy to make. They came out super thick and fluffy. They look amazing. My toppings that I have on this one, classic maple syrup and powdered sugar. 
You can do whatever toppings you like. Strawberries, whipped cream, blueberries, raspberries, bananas, Nutella, peanut butter, whatever you want. They're really easy to make. Go out there and make some. If I can do it, you can do it. I'm Matt Taylor. This has been another episode of In the Kitchen with Matt. Hope you enjoyed watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Take care. Time for me to dive into one of these. Ooh, yeah. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm.